So this is the HDMI Pi. It is a nine inch monitor um, that has been surrounded in a acrylic plastic case made by Pimaroni. The HDMI Pi is from Alex Eames of Raspberry TV and Syntec. Um, the nine inch monitor is essentially a screen out of a tablet such as uh, like a Nexus 7 and that type of thing. Um, it is a full 1080p monitor as you can see there and it has um, built into the case a Raspberry Pi and along with that it also has a secondary HDMI input. Um, the quality of the screen is really incredibly clear, incredibly crisp. These videos don't do it justice. Um, unfortunately, as soon as you try and film these types of things, um, a lot of the uh, frequencies of the actual panels themselves actually show up, which doesn't do it justice. So the first shot there was the, uh, the Pi behind it booting up, and the second shot here is my laptop um, that runs at a high uh, um, 1080p resolution plugged into the side of um, the HDMI Pi, and you can see how clear that is. Now the next thing I've connected into here is my Xbox One, uh, and this is the video game Destiny, which runs at full 1080p, 60 frames per second. Now when I was playing this, I was totally able to submerse myself into the game um, and found that uh, despite it not being um, like a full monitor, like a full television, it still was incredibly clear and incredibly playable. On the back of that, you have what you would expect to see on any monitor, which is the um, ability to switch between sources. You have um, uh, HDMI 1 and 2, also a VGA, which you can solder on. And you have the menu buttons, which allow you to go up and down through the menu, and a power um, button, which allows you to turn the monitor off completely. Now, here is what the menu looks like. It's what you would get in many typical uh, monitors. Ability to flip the screen in the orientation that you want. Uh, change a few color settings and play with the audio volume. You can see there there is a Pi built into the back of it. I happen to have a wireless dongle plugged into mine at the moment. Um, also, you have two mounting brackets, so you can warm out this, and they are um, you know, uh, unidirectional, so you can go up or down. And in the middle, you have the ability to add a Pi camera, which is a fantastic little touch added there. There is your secondary HDMI input and audio output, a normal um, power cable and a barrel ca power cable. Um, here is the board that you get with the kit. Um, the whole kit in total comes to uh, anywhere between £75 and about £100, depending on which accessories you've got. I bought mine with the, um, the stand there. And um, all in all, it is a fantastic kit that is really rounded. I cannot overemphasize how clear the screen is. It is a fantastic piece of kit, which I'd recommend that you go over and pre-order and um, you can get that over at hdmipi.com. If you like what we do here, like me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter, and please subscribe to the YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.